Here is a tutorial on how I made this flickering text effect on my last video. First, I open my Premiere Pro application and I click on the new item I choose the black video. Then I click on the black video and drag and drop it on my timeline. I click my text too and I input the letter I want to put there. For this one, I'll be writing changed. After that, I go to my essential graphics and I can highlight the whole text and change it, transform it, align it as much as I want. So here I'm aligning it. After that, I choose bold to make the letters quite bold and I align it once again just to keep it in the middle. I can choose any text. You can choose any text of your choice. I highlight the end and I change its fill color to red and its stroke to white. The stroke is not very necessary, but I'm adding it here because that was what I did in my previous video. So the stroke white, I'll put the stroke value to five so it doesn't it's not too much. And then I'm highlight the first two letters. Change the fill color to white and the stroke to red. Stroke still five. And the last three letters, I the fill color is already white, so I just change the stroke to red and that's it. After this stage, the next stage is to cut the text. So what I do is I choose my razor tool and I cut the text as much as I You can cut as many times as you want and it's not definite, it's not, there is no particular space you have to leave while cutting, it's anyhow you want it. And so after the cut, I chose the second cut. I change the text, completely opposite of what it is. I change, I highlight the end, change the fill color to white, stroke to red, And then the first three letters change their fill color to red and the stroke to white this time. The complete opposite of what the first frame is showing. After that, I delete the middle frames so that I can copy and paste the new frame I did. So what I do is I press alternate Left click and alternate to make a copy of that text. I made three copies of the text to fill in those three spaces. And then I just have to align them inside those spaces. After this step, the next step is to create the flickering effect. So here, we are going to reduce the timing of each text so that there will be a black frame in the middle. Once you are done with the reduction of the time, it's going to create that flickering effect, changing from the white to red and the red to white. 
Thank you very much and please subscribe to my channel for more videos.